So in this video guys, I'm gonna show you how to show all the step your mathematics step for uh, free. So there's an alternative website besides Mathway as yeah, as you can see from here, I'm just gonna retype, let's say for example, x to the power of 2 plus and then plus uh, no, 4x and then plus 16 and then it's equal to 0 and let's say I want to solve for x as you can see it's only displaying like the answer immediately but it's not really like displaying the uh, whole step so what I usually do is very simple you go to this website called emathhelp.net and what you're gonna do is find solve quadratic equation and after that you just type in your quadratic equation which is just now we did like x squared plus 4x plus 16 and you can solve it in two ways uh quadratic formula or complete the square but i prefer using the quadratic formula so when you click it you have your answer and these are like the steps that is already shown and this is like the solution so this is like an alternative website for math ways and yeah saves a lot of time and it's pretty useful i'm also gonna leave this link later on in the description down below and yeah see and for this video i'm just gonna show you like which of it it can do like i already showed you algebra let's say in geometry so what to do let's say Pythagorean theorem And let's say we want A to be like 8, and then B to be 9, and then C to be 10. And then just click on calculate. <laughs> and apparently, of course, it's too much data because it's an angle. And yeah, let's try it in radian. And it changes, but still too much data. But yeah, it's okay. And uh, it sh should help. Let's try, for example, in here 60. Maybe I need to put something in here 60 and 60. And then try to calculate. You know what? I'm just gonna do it in degree. Let's say 60 and 60. Try again. I'm just trying to test out. So apparently, sometimes you cannot do like Pentagorean theorem. So that's why in this video, I'm just gonna like test things out. So to make sure that this website is like really like applicable let's say for example solve the triangle just gonna put random numbers 8 9 10 and 45 and 45 and 45 just gonna put randomly And note, I'm just like guessing around, so you can just read like the instructions here, like if the calculator did not compute something or you have identified an error, you have to like look at, look back at it. 
Yeah, so this is like the geometry features. It's not that mm -hmm. much, but mm -hmm. like the algebra, but yeah. Maybe it's maybe this website isn't for you if you are want geometry. Yeah, let's try pre-calc. Let's say for example factorial. And you want the factorial, let's say number five. So number five is the factorial. We already gave an example. And uh, yeah, of course it's 120. It also gives you the step on how to do it. And let's try a little bit more. Uh, or let's try logarithms. So log is basically same thing as learn, but yeah. Let's, for example, I want to try like log base of 10. And E. Yeah, which is just again 2.3 something. And yeah, this is for pre calc. And what about calculus? Uh, calculus is. Let's try derivative it even gives you like how many times you want to differentiate so let's say for example x to the power of 3 and i want to differentiate it like two times and um, if i want i click on it it even shows you how how much it will become when it's already differentiated two times yeah, so actually, yeah, for calculus, definitely this website is the best. And um, for discrete math, uh, what to do? It's not really that much. They have maybe only combination and that. And permutation, and yeah, that's pretty much it. And... Yeah, definitely, this is for the discrete math. And probability and statistics, I want, just want to see. So we have like p-values, mean, median mode, and also z-scores. And then it says, if you want to put the z-score, you just click on calculate. And then, of course, it already gives you the example as it's already given in here and yeah also linear algebra there are like ma ma matrix of 3 by 3 adjoint matrix and everything you just need to search which one you need to do and yeah Let's try one more linear programming. Oh, linear programming is only like one. It's, I don't know, simplex method. And yeah, it even gives you like a sample example. You guys can edit it, by the way. So yeah, it's gonna pretty much show you like how it's done, basically. <clears throat> And yeah, that's basically it for the um, emathhelp.net. And yeah, so this is how you can uh, have another website besides Mathways. So hope you guys enjoy. Please don't forget to share this with your friends. And thank you guys for the video. And I'll see you when I see you.